Hello and w welcome to the final video that we have of this uh, course and we are amazed that you've made uh, through 14 modules uh, and hopefully you've learned a lot through all of the hard work that you've done in the past few months. Uh, we want to thank you for sticking with this, we want to thank you for working hard through it. We know that most of you, if not all of you, are working on real jobs at the same time. And so all of this kind of maybe takes away from time that you have with your families. Maybe it takes away from time that you have um, on, on other things that you would be choosing to do ordinarily. We hope that you feel that it's been tremendously worthwhile. It gets me to kind of my final comment on this is, this is worthwhile, but it's hard and it's costly. It takes a lot of time. The team who works with me in the field when we do PDIA, generally always comments on how emotionally demanding it is, how demanding it is on time, how demanding it is on relationships, how even when we're not in the field, we're spending an incredible amount of our time trying to think about the space we have to maneuver, uh, whether or not the authorizer, authorizing structures are as we understand them to be, thinking about how the iterations are going and whether people are working and whether they aren't working. We think that this commitment of emotion, this commitment of time, this commitment of energy is actually more than what you would find in most job situations. It's more than what is required in standard management approaches and standard project approaches in development where you fly in and you fly out and you use tools that allow you to engage at an arm's length uh, and to keep your heart with yourself and not in the place where you're working. I'd like to say up front, PDA is not about that. PDA is about engagement. PDA is about working hard, whether you're the outsider, whether you're about the insider, of engaging with the people in the place, engaging with the problems that are to be solved. Iterating again and again and again in your own mind, in your own team, with the people around you, around the hardest things that we have to deal with. Learning lessons that are hard to learn because I'm sure that every single person out there had some assumption at some point broken or proved incorrect or adjusted once they iterated or once they pressed a little bit into their context. It takes a lot of time, it takes a lot of energy, it takes grit. It's a word we used about authorizing environment and the importance of authorizers with grit. Well, you need to have grit too. Some people have said, can we have a light version of PDA, something that's a little less demanding? I don't think so. I don't think so, and maybe that's a drawback that means that some organizations won't do this. Maybe that means that it will never become the big uh, consulting model that people want it to be or that some people would like it to be. I think that this is the grit required to deal with the complex things that we're dealing with. Now it's been interesting because while some have said, can we have an easier model, other people have said, this is the first thing that we've seen that helps us deal with this type of problem. We haven't seen anything like this. And the grit is required because the problems we're dealing with are that big, that complex, and that important. So I want to encourage you as we come to the end of this to keep going. Because the first iteration is just the first iteration. Hopefully many of you in the first iteration learned so much that you realized that maybe your problem statement needs to be addressed again. That maybe you needed to go back and think about authority, acceptance, and ability. Maybe you realized that your iteration wasn't demanding enough, or maybe it was too demanding and you need to go back. This is all about going back. It's all about going back again and again and again and again, relentlessly, consistently, and continually addressing the problem tackling the status quo so that you can affect change. Please keep in touch as you do these things and please, please contact us if you need any motivation as you move along. You can motivate us too. Thank you.